caused me nothing there. Uh, been a very, very hectic and somewhat stressful weekend. Uh, very enjoyable. And uh, we got back yesterday and did not much apart from lie on the settee for a little bit and then we went to bed because we were absolutely buggered. It was a very hectic weekend. So, why was it a hectic weekend? Well, as you, many of you know, we were replay this weekend in the Norbrook Hotel in Blackpool. And a lot happened. Some good, some very good, and some bad. Some very bad. Yes, uh, when we were there, me and the wifey met uh, many people. Some we've met before, including UK Retro Games. And uh, some we've not seen before, like Steve Bemery, uh, Retro Replay, To You Dave, and a lot of other people I cannot at this point remember. Some of whom uh, came up and introduced themselves but didn't say who they were, so I don't know who you are. I can't shout you out in the video, unfortunately. Of course, for many people, the, the, uh, the expo was one of the reasons they went, but the main reason they went to the show was to kiss the Vortex. Oh yeah, the face of kissing of the Vortex. And uh, a few people gave her her kiss. So, let's see the footage, shall we? Give it a good bit of tonguing there. Whoa. Now, another thing of the show uh, was for Steve Benway to take up his promise of giving me a waltz. Now, he came up with this excuse as to why he could not rotate. It turns out that the Benway is a coward. Why is it that we weren't having a waltz, Benway? I just fell over and broke my leg and now I can't move. He's a lying bugger. <laughs> <laughs> Oh really, Mr. Benway? Break your leg, did you? That's your excuse, is it? Well, the Vortex went back in time and did some research as to how you broke your leg and came across this interesting footage from the night before. Unfortunately, the Vortex's SD card ran out just at the time you broke your leg. So we didn't get that footage. Sorry, but now we know the truth. This is why Mr. Benway could not waltz with me because he broke his leg. Waltzing was some other bugger. You cheating traitor, Mr. Benway! Anyhow, on a serious note, I'd like to thank everybody who. Uh, we saw made it a brilliant day. As uh, Steve Bentley said in his video, you could have taken the whole venue away and the group of YouTubers would still have had a great time talking amongst each other. Now, for some bad news that happened at Replay. You see, when we got there, uh, we parked the car up at this spot to be exact. And we went for a very nice meal with Mark here, UK Retro Games, Synth Monkey, uh, and uh, who I forgot to mention at the beginning of the video there. Sorry, Synth Monkey. But anyway, we came back after the meal and to find that the car was no longer there. <coughs> First of all, we thought the car had been stolen. Uh, and I spent about five minutes wondering if I'd actually parked it there. But when I concluded I wasn't insane that I, and I had parked it there, we looked around and we actually saw this sign. I opened them up and it seemed it had been towed. Yes, just little signs up on the wall. The boogers had towed it. So, what to do, what to do, what to do. 
Well, I phoned them up and uh, they wanted £325 to get this back. This is just a couple of hours after it had been towed. And they told us initially that this went up by the hour. Oh yes, they were trying to get some money out of us. So, we had to uh, go online and get one of these extortionate uh, payday loans to cover the money because we had not got that money. And uh, thanks to uh, Scent Monkey who came out and spent till 2 a.m. in the morning feeding us coffee and trying to get the car back for us, uh, he was a lot of help. And the next day he also lent us some money, which I've now returned to, uh, to help the sisters to get the car back. Because we would have been buggered without his help. Uh, we'd run the limit of the cash on the card that day and they would not accept card payment. So he lent us some money so we could get the car back and we now return that money to him via bank transfer. So my many thanks go out to Andy who uh, was our saviour that day. And we also like to thank Mark and his wife, Mark for here and his wife, who bought us lunch the next day and uh, the tea kept us in supply of tea because we had no money because we'd run up the limit on the card for that day thanks to these people who were in this company so that was uh, the bad experience but the good experiences outweighed it now there will be a second video because there were a lot of pickups we had at replay a lot of pickups so I will do a second video on that. In the meantime, please enjoy the footage and pictures we took at the event. Thank you. Va, 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 Go of a vengeance. Are you excited? <laughs> yes. <laughs> then let's go. Mind you, here we go. Basically, it's any time.
piece of my meat. <laughs> Don't I have a piece okay. of my meat? <laughs> He said something about the These foreign types are very, very friendly. <laughs>